This morning, the union representing port workers is threatening to strike in a matter of hours, which could lead to supply chain issues and potentially long-lasting impacts on the U.S. economy. It's estimated that a strike would cost somewhere around $5 billion a day. Negotiations between the Longshoremen's Union and the U.S. Maritime Alliance representing the shippers and ports are at a standstill. 45,000 dock workers are threatening to strike at midnight, stopping operations at 14 ports along the east and Gulf coasts. The crucial hubs from Texas to New England are responsible for nearly 35 percent of all U.S. imports and exports. A prolonged strike could result in delayed shipping times and higher costs for businesses like this toy store ahead of the holiday shopping season. A strike could totally... Uh totally hurt the business. The store gets kind of a whole transformation from Christmas time. Concerns are also growing about recovering from a strike. According to the National Retail Federation, a one-day shutdown takes three to five days to recover from. The longer it goes, the worse it gets. Union members are demanding higher wages and protections from automation. And we have to fight for what we rightfully deserve. Let's get a contract and let's move on with this world. President Biden has the power to stop the strike, but says he won't do that. He's urging both sides to negotiate fairly and quickly. The Maritime Alliance says it is committed to negotiating, but claims the union is not bargaining in good faith. Rhiannon Alley, ABC News, New York.